Hey y'all, I'm Parisian and this is Dream of Parisian Tarot. We're gonna get a few calls from my Aries, okay? So please like this video if it resonates at all. Also, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe and don't forget to check out my TikTok. The link is down below in the description box. And if you would like a personal reading, that information is also down below in the description box. So let's get a few calls from my Aries, okay? Alright, that's a lot that kind of came out now. But the first card I'm seeing... It says, I believe you now. Let me see what's under I believe you now. They still trying to figure out how to set you up. Okay, so somebody might not have believed what you were saying at first, and now they starting to see it, that there's a certain person that keeps trying to set you up, okay? about to bring you information so somebody's about to bring you some type of information or somebody then brought this information about this pe person trying to set you up they believe this shit now fighting over assets and property somebody could be doing it now that card also came out for it might have been leo so a leo could have something to do with this situation all right but it says it was nice to meet you under it was nice to meet you was regretful so somebody feels regretful for what they did to you or what they believed about you at first because they starting to see something is being exposed at this time they want to come to a compromise with you so they want to bring balance within the situation with you attention will be drawn to you so something that you're doing or posting um is drawing a lot of attention for you she trying to pull up at your spot, so somebody definitely got beef with you. Cause, yeah, they keep trying to set you up, right? It's some type of mess in the workplace going on. If you ain't having no mess or drama at your workplace, um, it could be your person or somebody around you. But it says a loved one getting out of jail. So somebody could have went to jail or something like that. And the karmic wants to sleep with divine feminine though. So whatever karmic they was dealing with also wants to have sex with you or thinking about some type of threesome on the low. There's someone who might have had a toxic upbringing. We got cold as fuck. And mother figure sending you the evil eye. So this could be your mother. His mother. Somebody's mother is giving someone the evil eye at this time. Also, we have somebody collects ancient artifacts. So someone could definitely be a tarot reader. A psychic or something. In this you also have calling you in your dreams calling you in your dreams so somebody calling you in your dreams uh communicating with you or something like that or trying to tell you something we got living with mom someone could be doing that and we also have childhood lover so you could have a childhood lover that could be coming back or wanting to talk to you we got brownies so someone could be eating brownies also somebody could be like a little stressed out or depressed about something as well what else we got all right, we got gold teeth. Spirits to transmitted demons. And this is why you got to be careful with who you associate with and who you deal with, okay? Can't let everybody in your energy. I'll never give up on us. Marrying into royalty. So someone could definitely be marrying someone who could be royalty or could be a very abundant person who was born that way, right? We got a security guard or somebody could work in security. Your aunt's friend is involved in this situation. The streets are talking about this. So a lot of people are talking about this situation that's going on revolving around you. All right, we got worried about car payment. So somebody could be having financial issues. Falling in love with you. She holding a grudge against you. So there's a female energy who has an issue with you and they're holding a grudge. You're an inspiration to a lot of people. So a lot of people could look up to you and listen to you. They are inspired by you. And your ancestors came to lift you up. So they also are trying to support you and protect you in some type of way as well. Friend is fucking your man. So somebody has a, um, a fucked up friend that's fucking their person or trying to blaming you for everything that happened so somebody's pointing the finger at you all right let me put this to the side here we have buying new furniture so someone could be moving or relocating or just buying new furniture for their home 
and hired a spiritual practitioner on you. So someone went to a, a spiritualist or a tarot reader or something like that to get some information on you. We got baby dreams. So someone's definitely contacting you in your dreams. They could be telling you that they want a baby or something about a baby or, or something about a new beginning because babies are also known for new beginnings as well. But something is definitely going on in your dreams. They have a demon attachment, yes. So we got spiritually transmitted demons, okay? They're trying to be in your energy or involved with you in some type of way, but they have a whole demon attachment. Now, everybody don't see that, though. Everybody don't see that they got some type of demon energy trying to attack them or make them do certain things. You know what I'm saying? They mad at what you post, so somebody feel like you posting about them or talking about them or exposing them in some type of way. And we help, we make a good team. So somebody feels like you and them make a good team. Family got in the way. So either your family got in the way of this connection or their family did. Linking with positive-minded people, which is very, very good. And wants to spend more time together. So this person wants to spend time with you, but there's some type of blockage of people causing issues. But they, uh, someone could need your help. You could be making big moves or about to. And they suffering in silence without you. They feeling under pressure. And they want to marry you. We got ring here. Somebody get married. Ring. We got cosmetic surgery. Or someone could be talking about another person's beauty or something like that. They could be thinking somebody got cosmetic surgery. A cancer could be involved in this situation. And wanting to be paid more. So somebody needs more money or wants more money. And someone is crying over you. We got outgrew old friends. So somebody mad that you cut them off. Could, they could have been a mess ass bitch. The karmic turned on them. So whatever karmic that he was dealing with, they turned on them. Someone could be focusing on their accounting and finances. So somebody could work in accounting and finances. But yeah, they switching sides. And when switching sides comes out, that means that somebody was exposed. Somebody been lying about some shit. Now they exposed. Yeah. They were trying to find ways to attack you. They were still trying to set you up. Not everybody see. I believe you now. The exposure. They tried to frame you. We got messy co-worker. And somebody want to have a date night with you. There we go, Aries. So, it could definitely be more than one Aries involved in this situation. Stress that. Upset about your strength. You're too strong. You're too smart. They can't fight you. Trying to pull you into some mess, which means it's group activity going on. It's a group collaboration going on. Multiple people talking about this. That's why you had the car talking about the streets and talking about this. There's some type of telepathic communication going on between you and your person. They wish they had your gift. Somebody is gifted here. Somebody could be a reader here, a spiritualist here. Very intuitive. I'm hooked on you. Planning fitness. Somebody exercising or wanting to. Helping with grandkids. Some of y'all could have grandkids. The whole family feeling regretful now because they believe some bullshit, but now they believe you now. Somebody could be in a rocky relationship or having issues in their relationship. Praying for redemption so you could be redeeming yourself. Or they could be redeeming themselves. Like some of y'all want to redeem yourselves in something. Some of y'all could have believed some bullshit at first. Alright. This whole group is under judgment for trying to cause delays for you. It was a group of people. Again, it keeps saying it. They copy off you and talk shit about you at the same time. Ain't that crazy? I'm sorry, they want to apologize. Empowerment group or event. You could be empowering others because people like to look up to you and listen to you. Some of y'all have a platform where a lot of people look up to you and listen. They tried to bring harm your way. They tried to do everything to you to stop you. You could be a very sexy lady. Wanting you to be a part of a poly relationship so they could have put you in a third party situation. Uh, someone could be a bus driver. New body shaper. I think that came out for Aquarius reading as well. 
We got mushroom coffee. Yes, that's a much better alternative. Their cover was blown. Somebody exposed. Spiritual advice. Somebody's a spiritualist. So somebody going to a spiritualist or a tarot reader, psychic or something. Someone could have long hair. Homeboy interferes. Somebody homeboys want to fuck. Yeah. In need of emotional connection. I think this was. Uh, that could definitely be a Taurus involved in this situation too, okay? People think you are heartless. So a lot of times when that card comes out, some of y'all definitely try to protect yourself or defend your, yourself in some type of way. Uh, they want you to come out more. So they definitely want to hang with you. But it says she can't accept it's over. So he cut somebody off or a female energy got cut off. They get mad that they did that and they want to take it out on you. But you also had a card talk about the karma turned on him. The karma turned on him because he cut the ass off. Filing for a divorce. Somebody could be filing for a divorce at this time. You could you could be a high valued woman. A lot of people want you. Somebody could be a customer service representative. They gave misleading info on you. They were sitting up their line. Somebody could work at a post office. Yeah, the spell not working. They tried to do hex on your finance. They was mad about your abundance, your money and shit. Wishing you the worst. Wishing you to fail. Linking up at a party. Be careful who you party with. Sexual thoughts. Also, no. If this is not happening directly to you, it could be happening to your person or somebody around you. So, put it with every fits, okay? I could be saying he when really it could be a she. So, flip it and reverse it how need be. Alright, what else we got here? Let's see. Whew. As soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Aries is we got connections. You need to be making better connections at this time. We are all connected by a universal sea of energy. All that you think and do will have an effect on your world. Reach out and connect with the world around you through love okay so there's many people that could be trying to contact you in some type of way um or have some type of communication with you period also something could be going on on social media see all these hands all these people it's a lot of people that's why we kept on seeing groups of people it was a team uh um the streets talking about this stuff like that there are a lot of people talking about some type of situation that's going down all right on the other side, you got celebrations and social occasions. So social, a lot of people, uh, parties, events, groups. Are you concerned about commitment? Do you have fears around social situations? Would you like to break free from the repressed you? So somebody could be trying to break away from some type of toxic groups or messy groups or something like that because somebody don't want to be involved in negativity cards for my Aries. And something definitely going down on social media right now. You could... You cannot be trusting certain people. It's trust issues. Trust yourself and the universe plan for you. Do not give your trust to others lightly. Look, do not give your trust to others lightly. When one door closes, another opens. We got chased. What are you running away from? What is making you feel overwhelmed? What are you afraid of or are unwilling to face? So you might not want to face certain people or situations right now. You could be running away from negativity. That's what I'm seeing. I don't blame you. Got gangs. Somebody playing mind games and shit. Somebody trying to confuse you. Somebody trying to lie to you. Do you feel that you need more fun and play in your life? Is someone playing games in your work or personal life? Do you need a game plan to improve your status or direction? You could be trying to go through, to a different direction away from mind games and people trying to play with your intelligence and shit. Communication. A whole bunch of it. Trying to come in. What are you having difficulty communicating? Do you feel emotionally disconnected? What is not working smoothly in your life? And I feel like it's People, people are are losing your trust. You might not trust nobody around you, okay? Something ain't fucking right with this shit here. And you noticing that shit. You noticing a lot of shit. That's what I'm seeing. All right. 
as soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Aries is we got the Queen of Pentacles. So some of y'all are definitely focused on your health, wealth, and beauty, your fitness. All right, and your money could be looking good or it's about to look good. Okay, what's on the other side? Seven of Wands. All right, so you could be defending yourself, okay? You could be trying to stay away from negativity, like I was saying. You blocking something that something is being blocked, okay? And we got the sun. Somebody tried to block the truth from coming out, but it's coming out anyway. And again, a Leo could have something to do with this situation because I'm seeing Leo energy again. So it's like some type of information coming out. A lot of people are focused on whatever the fuck that was exposed. And somebody just don't want to be a part of all that mess and drama. The Ten of Pentacles. This, this could have something to do with family, right? All right. So somebody's family members could be worried about somebody's love situation. So people are heavily focused on your love situation. Also, you could have a spiritual union with another person, but they had choices in love. So someone could have put you in a third party. This person could already have a family as well. Let's see. I'm seeing heavy Gemini energy right now. And we got the five of swords. So people are trying to attack you and your person. Because they want to know more about what y'all got going on. Or they mad because he want to give you the roses. But somebody playing mind games and trying to trick another person out of their relationship or something. Because somebody had options in love. So somebody could have definitely been cheating. But it's like you the one they want to be with or something. And now they want to attack you. Out of all the people that he was dealing with. It's, they know that you the one. Now we got the ten of cups. I'm seeing two tens. So family. So this not only could it be your family, but it could be their family too. So both sides of the family could all be, um, oh yeah, both sides of a family is all up in this. It's a lot of mess going on. And we got a queen of cups. Could be a cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, but somebody emotional and sensitive as fuck. What's at the bottom? Seven of wands. But they trying to guard and protect themselves. Everybody want to know your business or be in your business, and you don't trust none of they motherfucking ass. Four of cups, somebody feel rejected and neglected. That's the uh, the six of ones. Is that the nine of ones? The six. Of, this is six of ones. So somebody getting a lot of success and recognition, and they feel bad. They feel bad because they rejected you or something like that. But you know what? The energy that I just got off of this is that somebody hurt you or tried to sabotage you and you still end up being successful. Now somebody may. That's what I'm getting from this. They was a hater the whole time, but nothing that they did to attack you came out the way that they wanted Let me see. You still got praised. Because they, they tried to demolish your shit or something. It didn't work. Can I get one more call here? See what's going on. Yeah, you moved away from the negativity. You got the fuck away. They're like, how the fuck did this bitch get away? How did this bitch get out of this and they tried to trap her? What the fuck? The sun. You went straight to your motherfucking happiness. You 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 became happy anyway. And they mad as fuck that you got this happiness. You won. They feel like you won. And somebody want to get you pregnant or somebody arguing about a pregnancy or a baby situation or something. It's like you went through a whole fucking rebirth and you won and you out here looking beautiful. It could be some type of party or event coming up as well or somebody might invite you. Oh, it could be your birthday as well. Five and one, but somebody in competition with you. They want to burn your goddamn dress up. Your dress looking real cute. Whatever you wearing looking real cute and they want to burn your damn dress up. Fucking hating. Something about that color red. And something about the color red was coming out for Scorpios too. So a Scorpio could be involved in this situation as well. All right, as soon as I open up the deck, what we see for my um Aries. They longing for you. I just want to hold you and kiss you all the time. They fantasizing about you and stuff. And we got bright light. It says you are an inspiration to others and your light shines bright. So you could be a spiritual guide, a teacher, a mentor, or some sort. 
All right, for my Aries, what we got? Longing came out again. They definitely doing that for you. And you out here glowing. But look, though, look who wants to be seen. Somebody emotionally unstable. Someone is stressed out and losing their mind, but you glowing. You're passionate about the things you care about in this show. You're undeniable talent to shine so bright. And somebody losing their fucking mind because you still shine the fuck bright and they try to dim your light. They try to destroy you. They try to cut out your happiness or something. <coughs> they want me to shut the fuck up right now. You going through a transformation. Things are changing. Changing endings are just new beginnings. That's what you're about to have. <coughs> One of my Aries, please. All right, what that is. And you out here looking sexy, seductive. Your sensuality is attractive and your scent is intoxicating. You are desirable, powerful, and alluring. But somebody upset about their finances. Ain't nothing like feeling safe and secure. Life is all about balance, save money, and make a plan for future investments. So somebody having a lot of anxiety, they're strategizing. Um, you might want to use aromatherapy as well. Let me see. Oh, all right, something failed. Hold on. And the card that fell was possessive. You being with someone else pisses someone off. Heartbreak, angry, and mind. So you could be dealing with another person or they feel like you're dealing with another person. Because like I said, somebody got choices in love. Uh, somebody might have put you in a third-party situation. But they don't want you to be with nobody else. At the bottom of the day, we got spark. So take some time to live and enjoy life. It will only inspire your work. All right, so create inspired new ideas. People are um, inspired by you. Um... Now you're about to have some type of new spark or new beginning. Okay? As soon as I open up the engine for my Aries is, they worried about what you creating. So you creating something new or about to do something new. Motherfuckers worried because they wish you would fucking fail. Okay? <laughs> this shit is sad. You, you a sad, pathetic motherfucker sitting up there trying to do shit and wishing that on people. This is sad. What the fuck? Aries. I'm your friend, but they are doing you wrong. And I don't want to be a part. I told y'all somebody don't want to be a part of that shit. They're trying to get away from that shit. They got somebody watching you. Copying your personality and this some sad shit. Because you on some next level shit. Polly love again. Somebody really wanted Polly or really been putting you in third party situation or something. I can't believe I fell for that. They fell for the balloon. But the, the uh balloon. I almost said balloon. So somebody's birthday definitely happened. Um are you still mad at me? Hell yeah. The fuck? You're into I told you they tried to play with your fucking intelligence like you stupid, like you just gonna believe lies. And somebody friend. Friend interfering with your lover. Party time. Yeah, a birthday or something like that. And this sticking out. His friends gossip about you and want you at the same time. So it's homeboy definitely want you, okay? All right, y'all. The finale. Let's see. As soon as I... Yeah, somebody... It's multiple people watching your situation or this shit going down. And they just waiting for the finale. As soon as I open up the deck... They are trying to use your personal information against you. They trying everything they can. They trying to throw everything at you. People are wanting to take out revenge on your behalf. People want to come in and help you because they see this shit that's being done to you. And, and you know what's really pissing them off? That they actually believe this shit that was being said about you. Now they feel like their intelligence was fucked with. Now they feel like this motherfucker must have thought I was stupid to believe this shit. You see what I'm saying? Cars from my Aries. All right. You're funny if you think I'm going to let you love her in peace. So people really don't want y'all to be together. They was hoping you couldn't afford to be in the same spot as the rich and popular. Mad as fuck, too. And you have connections in the angelic realm. Y'all tapped in. Y'all connected to spirit. They mad about that shit, too. Saying something about mother-in-law from hell. So somebody catching hell from their mother-in-law. Can somebody like you be faithful to me? They wondering. You could be wondering that about someone as well. 
They envy the men that you attract. So it's a certain man that you got or has their eyes on you. And another person is mad as fuck about that shit. They've been secretly recording you and acting like you, but talking shit about you and trying to destroy you at the same time. Fake a pot. They full of shit. Do not accept that bullshit. Divine masculine is thinking you are the best option. He know it. Paperwork is processing. So we did see divorce. Somebody filing for divorce. Or somebody could be working on something else right now. Look at this shit here. No one is listening to the karmic's lies anymore. They see that that person was a liar. Astro sex. Because somebody definitely hitting up your dreams and shit. Okay. Fake pages are watching you. They want to be in your business. And it says she won't stop bothering him about why he don't want to be with her anymore. There are so many things that I never got to say to you. Okay. We'll be on y'all. 23. Let me hurry up. All right. It says, people are seeing that you are so sweet, but the karmic made you seem evil. And get your own money so men won't use money to control you. You don't know it yet, but I'm going to surprise you with a ring. Because that's what I'm saying. Somebody want to get married to their person, but it's like both sides of the family could be being messy about the shit or something. Someone could be a jury maker. And it says, I would lose my mind if I lost you. I just can't get over you, and this is sticking out. You're not bougie. They're just broke. So they hating off your abundance and the things that you have and shit because they broke. I almost said Taurus, too. So a Taurus definitely got something to do with this. You could be meditating outdoors or you need to. But look at this here. These people got demon attachments, demonic spirits connected to their ass, and they don't realize it. He ended things with her. Now she mad at you. Now she wants to attack you listening to that damn demon in him. He feels like the karmic's time already ran out. We ain't got shit to talk about. Tired they motherfucking ass. And daddy, listen. Li no, listen. I said listen. Somebody was listening to that bullshit. But anyway, lending out money and things to people to have something over their head. So either either he gave they, them money or they gave him money. Okay. But it says, he is going to make them put some respect on your name. He ain't playing about you. And again, mother-in-law from hell. So, please like this video if it resonates at all. Thank y'all so much. I love y'all.